at all this broken down right here. <laughs> Looking close to the left and right. What's up, everybody? Get my pop out. I am Kaz Isaiah. Clearly some large beast that roams through here. Look at it. You can see the trail. This is a palm tree. Some beast knocked over. All the grass broken down. Going up through here. It's definitely the right area. And this is the swamp where the blue-eyed beast of Sri Lanka lives. Seeing this one pop its head up. I was like, oh, more dangerous. Oh, who's this? Our mission today is going to find this beast. It's somewhere in the swamp. Let's go. Kohomada. Hola. Hi. Neighborhood Yunyans, half. The cheapest hotel in all Sri Lanka. Hola. Friendly kids. All right, here we go. The angry dogs begin already. Counting two dogs. Listen here, dogs. You're gonna calm down. Come on, do a sneak attack. A sneak attack on me from behind, probably. What about you, dog? You want some of this? Kohomada. Ready? So, first dog attack, thwarted. My freaking earphones keep falling out. All right, cross the track. Spot coming up here. It's like a hotel or a house on the lake. It's pretty nice. Off to the side right here. That giant window there. My kind of place. Surrounded by crocodiles. <laughs> so if anyone tries to break in, they get eaten alive. Blair Doggo. Doggo. Oh, Kohomada. Kohomada. <laughs> Happy village people of Sri Lanka. All right, so from the cheapest hotel in Sri Lanka, it was like a eight minute walk across that main road, this back road that goes into the village. Uh, that was like my little walk warm up. Now we're about to run to this blue eyed beast. So the story about this, I found this hidden little running trail way back in the village of Midigama, Sri Lanka in the south running upon this uh, dirt trail just looking straight ahead this giant beast pops out these bright blue eyes <laughs> so I just started running but it just rose up from the darkness and mud these blue eyes so we're got to, about to run through this village through this trail see if we can find it again listen here dogs they freaking hate when you're running through their village I know this is your village but I'm gonna need to pass I'm gonna need to pass, dog. I'm gonna need to pass. I don't have time for all this. What about you, dog? Go, go. Friendly dog. The one over there always tries to get me. All right. So. Just start this run there. It's about three kilometers to there. Jeez, dog, super aggressive. You guys just calm down. I forgot. No, 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 no. 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 Hey. Listen here, dogs. I got a blue eyed beast to go find. <laughs> You guys calm down. Jeez. All right, let's try to start this run again. This dog might be more dangerous than this beast. Almost got my ankles chopped off. 
Oh, look at this one up here. What are you doing up there, dog? I think you're a cat or a tiger. You see, I gotta go through all these, all these obstacles just to get to this trail. And I'm almost at the trail right now. Just across this bridge right here. We're gonna go left first, then right. Super nice trail for running though. So before when I ran here, the first time I was like, whoa, what's that growling sound? What the hell? That is crazy. The last time I was, one of the first times I ran through here, I was like, this place looks right for alligators to come out the side and chomp me. Didn't see one a few times I ran out here. Then recently, I've seen one pop its head up. I was like, oh, more, more dangerous. Whoa, what was that sound? More dangerous animals on this trail here. So maybe we'll see an alligator or something. Now I'm always super cautious, looking close to the left and right. Something might pop out Rah! and get me. This little bridge right here. Over there. I'm there. How thick it is back here. It's super nice. All right. Run again, let's go. Look out for the alligators. Snakes. <clears throat> okay, I don't know what that sound was. It's not much of a weird sound. Everything sounds like it's coming out to attack me here. Nice. Soft dirt road. This down palm tree. Let's be weary of the animals. You may come across. All right, once I reach the end of this trail, go back the other way. Cross this thin little bridge right here. I spy 50 crocodiles, no. But they're in there. I know they are. I wonder why there's a little bridge right here. Let's go to this path, maybe to the train over there. But we're not running on the railroad tracks. We're looking for the blue-eyed beast. I'm gonna start running the other way. Let's get this beast hunt going on. Time check, 5.22. Sunset is near, dark is coming upon us. It's about 82 degrees. I don't know the Celsius, maybe 28. A few kilometers in, back at the bridge. We're going across. This is the side. I've seen the beast at before. Pause the timer. My tracking watch for the run. Stop running because this is around the area where I last seen the beast. So I'm trying to creep a little more quietly. Crazy bird in the bushes back there. You know how quiet it is out here. It's very quiet. Last time he pounced, I was just running past here. It was like all black, covered in mud. Only seeing his blue eyes piercing through my soul. Then I ran like a coward. See, he's surrounded by swamp on both sides. Giant white uh, birds. What are those called? Storks? Oh, heard something out there. It's just a bird. Where are you at, beast? You're gonna make me look like a fool in front of all of YouTube out here. I promised them a blue-eyed beast. Where are you at? What was that? And there, is that a monkey? I've never seen a monkey on this trail before. Something in there. Show yourself. Ah, monkey, I knew it. Monkey. Can you tell us where the, where the beast is from up there? We need your vantage point. Monkey. There you are. Hello. Monkey, we need your help. First of all, grab me a coconut, then we'll talk. Where I saw the crocodile, <laughs> somewhere over here. It's waiting for him to pounce. It's a big ass bird. Pterodactyl type birds out here. Oh. That's right 
on this corner right here. Beastie, beastie, beastie. Beastie. The woods. This is the spot it was. It came out. Again, look at those trails. Beast crunching through here. Come on, beast. I'll not be a coward this time. <laughs> Maybe. Look at this. Just giant paths. The beast lives. Alright, so it appears we failed today. Could not find the beast looking, searching, running through these swamps, being gawked at by monkeys, hearing a bunch of weird sounds. Big ass fire ants though trying to get me right here. So, if you are ever in the backwoods of Sri Lanka, in the jungle, in distant swamps that look similar to this, when you think all is well, you think the day is quiet and the night is long. Just beware. The blue-eyed beast of Sri Lanka, it still lurks out there. Make no mistake about it. Just when you're not looking. Yuh!